When and how you sweep is a vital part of curling. You uh, do all your uh, shots with the, with the sweeping, so it's uh, very important for the curling. So maybe the main thing right now, how we can have the teams to sweep better, so we can actually have a higher stats Sweepy and makes make more the stone shots. travel further and curl less, increasing the chances of getting your stones to where you want them to go. The ice you basically make uh, make the ice a little bit warmer, and the, uh, the stones just slide above it. it. It doesn't grip as much in the ice as it would if you wouldn't sweep. What you use to do your sweeping is even more important. The type of brush or broom can make a substantial difference to how far that stone travels, whether it's the corn broom, the push or hair brush, or the synthetic brush. It's really important. Uh, I think nowadays uh, the the material you use in the brushes are it's, it's quite optima, optimist, optimal for brushing, actually. Uh, I think uh, you couldn't do much more with the material. Like all sports equipment, curling brushes have evolved over the years. There aren't too many corn brooms around anymore. What were the main disadvantages of the corn broom in curling? Well, you need a lot of power, like it really exhausted you for much more than probably the, the brushes today and also like the dirt. On the one hand you can use it, on the other hand it causes some disadvantages it's because on purpose sometimes the rocks really picked up and uh, this was one of the major disadvantages. Of, and the effectiveness of uh, the effectivity of those brooms was not so good as, as the brushes are today. So it's a good thing for the sport that they have the brushes of today? Well, it has been fun and it has been a lot of noise, a lot of action but the effectivity is really, it is a disadvantage today, you can say. This is a hairbrush, a lot of teams are using it to keep the frost away in front of the stones. It's not that hard to start to sweep with, but the, the top teams today, they work as hard as we did on the corn brooms with these uh, sweepers as well. The synthetic brush is the most common brush used by curlers. The movement of the pads creates friction and heats up the ice, so the stones go further. Uh, it's a carbon fibre with a synthetic uh, head that you use, and it, the weight it's almost nothing. Yep. We can't make the stone go faster, but we can make it go longer by not having it breaking down too, too early. How much of a difference in um, lengthwise could a brush like that make compared to a corn broom? Yeah, in the circumstances today, I think we can at least say two, three meters. But a brush is only as good as its sweeper. Good sweepers have incredible arm, core strength, and good flexibility. You want to have uh, sweepers who can have a lot of pressure down to the ice through the br brush head and also move it as, as fast as possible. I'm so pleased we don't need to do this anymore.